Today we're diving into the latest and greatest from Premiere Pro Beta's newest update. The first couple of things are sick, but the last thing is mind-blowing. And the secret is, it's actually been in Premiere Pro this entire time. So first things first, to access Premiere Pro Beta, go to the Creative Cloud desktop app and then find Premiere Pro Beta in the Beta app section, then install it. Once it's installed, click open. Hey guys, the sponsor of this video is actually me and my team. You're actually sitting here in front of a computer right now editing when you should actually be out building relationships with your friends and your family. Click the link in the description to get a crazy discount on our total collection bundle, which will cut your editing time in half and free you away for having to work all day on the computer. I'm gonna give you all of these crazy, incredible effects packs for this crazy low price. Click on the link to support us, but more importantly, to support yourself. Okay, so what's new in this new update? First, let's start off with the interactive fade handles. These are literally new fade handles with, wait for it, adjustable curves. I'm serious, this is crazy. So here's how to use them. Click on the audio clip in your timeline and find the little square handles at each end and then just drag to create a custom fade. Click into the fade and adjust it to your liking. It's that easy. It's intuitive, no more menus, no more hassle. Now, do you want to crossfade in between two clips? Easy. Just push those two clips together and watch as they blend seamlessly. Whether you're gently leading into a scene or smoothly exiting, these handles offer total control and precision. And the best part? It's all done right in the timeline. Now guys, up next we're going to talk about the genius of AI-powered audio category tagging. Now, imagine your clips getting automatically labeled as dialogue, music, or effects. That's what's happening with this new audio category tagging feature. And what this does is it makes quickly distinguishing audio clips that much easier during a hectic edit. To see this in action, first you gotta import all of your audio files. Then highlight all the clips that you want to auto tag and then click the auto tag button. Premiere Pro's AI will analyze and tag them under categories. Clicking a category badge even opens the essential sound panel, directly connecting you to the most relevant tools. Now let's talk about clip effects badges. Think of these as like audio editing shortcuts. To use them, click on an audio clip, and then you'll see badges for different effects. Click on a badge, and it'll open a menu with a range of effects to choose from. Select one, and it'll instantly be applied. This is ideal for quickly adding reverb, compression, or any other effect, streamlining your process. Plus, they help you identify which clips have effects already, enhancing the visual clarity of your timeline. And for those that appreciate the finer things, the quality of life improvements are a delight. To see waveforms better, simply adjust the track height and the waveform resizes accordingly. This is really great for detailed edits. The updated clip colors offer greater visibility, making it easier to differentiate between various clips at a glance. Now guys, I know some of these tweaks might seem a little minor, but I feel like that they actually significantly enhance the overall editing experience, providing a more intuitive and visually pleasing interface. Now, I told you there was one last thing that was gonna blow your mind, and I was dead serious. Have you ever had trouble mixing dialogue audio with background music? You just never can get the levels quite right. The music's either too loud or too quiet. Adobe's gonna try to convince you to use their new audio ducking tool in Premiere Pro and Premiere Pro Beta as the primary way to mix dialogue with background music. Don't listen to them. Don't do it their way. Do it our way. It's a hundred times better, it's a hundred times easier, and a hundred times faster. And it's been a secret up until now. Check it out in this next video right here. That's it, guys.